2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. A look from earlier as the Nets head to the locker room. They're in no mood to let this game get away from them on their home turf. Terrific view of the nighttime traffic between Manhattan and our setting tonight, Brooklyn, New York. It's time to kick off the postseason, round one, game one of the Eastern Conference playoffs. And you can just feel the energy here tonight. Hello, basketball fans. Brian Anderson here, courtside with Doris Burke and Grant Hill. Our reporter is Allie LaForce. Allie, it's all yours. Brian, thanks. Kyrie Irving has settled in Brooklyn after his time in Cleveland and Boston. He said, I'm grateful to be in a position to set a better example now. What I learned was, even on the bad days, you have to galvanize the group. And there isn't one leader. It's the balance of leadership. Guys? Ah, wise words, Allie. Thank you for that. You look at Brooklyn, they had a great season and are expected to control their destiny in this series. I'll tell you what, it'd be a shock if they didn't run through this series. With that said, we know anything can happen in the postseason. So a look at the starters for the Pacers. Warren and Sabonis, the duo at forward. Then there's T.J. McConnell. Then there's Miles Turner. And it's Dorte in at the shooting guard position. And for the Nets, Harris and Durant in as the forwards. James Harden out there with Kyrie Irving. And it's Aldridge in at the center position. It'll be the Nets off the tip. Harden with it. Outside Durant from the arc. It's rebounded by Indiana. Now McConnell. Driving in. Uses the glass to finish the layup. And that gets us rolling. Whew. What a tremendous atmosphere in here tonight. You get the sense there is a level of intensity right out of the gates. Now here's Harden. Pass to Durant. Back to Harden. Down low. Here's Irving. It's tipped. Here's Duarte. Defended by Harden. And that one goes in as he's fouled. It'll be three points if he converts the free throw. The Nets with possession here. It's a five-point game. Pass to Harris. Outside Durant. Six on the shot clock. Whistle blows. Yep, that's going to be a travel. An outstanding defensive play to earn the mobile one block. Oh, you could feel the playoff intensity in that block. He's playing some extra aggressive defense out there. Here's Indiana. Pass to Warren. First minute and a half of basketball played here in this one. Harden against McConnell. Back to Warren. Fires from deep. He can't get it to go. And Brooklyn going the other way now. Here's Harden. Into the lane. And so he draws the foul. Headed to the line to shoot a pair. It's on T.J. McConnell. A few guys do this as easily as Harden. Driving in hard and drawing a foul while taking the shot.
Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That's good from Harden. And let me throw out one of my favorite James Harden notes. He's the only player in history to score 30 points in a game against all other 29 teams in the league in a single season. Harden hits them both. This is about the last guy you want to send to the stripe right now. They keep fouling him, and he keeps making them. McConnell passes to Warren. Turner with it. He's covered by Aldridge. Oh, it's blocked by Aldridge. A quick leaper with good instincts. Aldridge can be so disruptive as a defender. Well, you have to be cognizant of where people are when the shot goes up. Defenders not blocking out in that instance. Now here's Harris. Blocked! Still looking to get their offense in gear. 0 for 3 to start this game. Outside Warren. Duarte puts up a three and he can't get that one given his range you'd expect him to capitalize on that open Aldridge with it Harris outside and Aldridge with the basket on the assist by Harris such a nice touch on the ball from Aldridge he knows exactly how much power to put on the inside shot Pass to Duarte. To the middle. Here's Turner. After missing his first attempt, now one for two. The ability to play through contact is so important for Miles Turner. He's got the size and strength to finish through it. Outside Irving. Now here's Duran. He's guarded by Sabonis. Sabonis against Harden. From deep three-point range. Oh, Sabonis with a block. Here's McConnell. Two shots, two makes. Off to a good start. The big story thus far, how well they've shot the rock. Brooklyn has gone 0 for 2 from outside. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. Harden. And he sinks that one, hitting the back of the rim on the way in. You've got to appreciate the consistency. Night in and night out. Brings it. That's to Duarte. Now it's a bonus. Again, the Pacers. Good for two more. And guys, the way this defense is getting manhandled down low, you have to wonder if they're at 100% right now. Oh, and Turner with a block. Miles Turner with that length sends it back twice on the pipes. Miles. The Nets have gone only two of seven so far. A cold start. Harris finds Durant. Tries again. And he sinks the layup. Second chance points are always painful. Have to make the effort to box out. No doubt those extra possessions can really add up against you when you do not take care of the defensive glass. Here's McConnell after the basket by Brooklyn. Here's Duarte. Kyrie Irving clears the rebound. Aggressive mindset, but the defender just as determined to send him away empty-handed. Harris' shot is good. Well, Kyrie Irving, if you're open, he will find you. This guy is a scorer, but he understands others have got to come along with him. Now here's Warren. Boy, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Up top, Turner. Let's it fly. And once again, off the mark by Indiana. Brooklyn trailing. Outside for Harden. Back to Duran. Jacks up a three. Hits the trifecta. Durant's got his second basket of the night. Don't you love how decisive Kevin Durant is on the offensive end? He doesn't think twice before he lifts from long range. Pass to Duarte. 
laid it in with a nice touch off the window. He's got five. They have no answer defensively inside. Outside Harden. To the paint. Here's Aldridge. That one's good for two. Though he does have a scorer's mindset, Harden's vision and experience playing alongside some of the best talent in the league have made him an awesome playmaker. Now here's McConnell. Takes it inside. Oh, it's blocked. It deflects off the backboard. Here's Harris. And Harris throws it down. I'll tell you, more than just a shooter, Joe Harris has the ability to put it on the deck and get to the cup. McConnell passes to Sabonis. Shoots over Harden. No good on the shot. And Brooklyn going the other way now. No question, this offense has some firepower. <laughs> and they're looking very confident in all that they're doing right now. Uh, guys, how good is Kyrie Irving at shielding off defenders and getting the soft shot up on the drive? Now a timeout called by Indiana. Things just aren't going their way. He clearly wants to talk it over. Well, night in and night out, sometimes it's a battle of runs. Who has the most? A full line change here for Brooklyn. Levert passes to Smith. Pulled the shot a little left. The bounce goes his way, though. And despite the defender's length, he goes right up from the mid-range. Well, I'll tell you, I love that he's not afraid to take on the size mismatch there, Greg. It doesn't matter. Just make shots. Now here's Mills. Pass to Griffin for three. It's rebounded by Indiana. And here's LeVert. From outside the arc. Drills it from deep. And the Pacers lead by one. Boy, this is the next step for Karis LeVert. Critical. He become more consistent from deep. And it's Brown off the drive. And the rebound goes to the Pacers. Sabonis has got four rebounds now. Here's LeVert. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. His first foul. I like that. I mean, some physical play inside. He's not about to give up any easy baskets. And a look now at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for the Pacers. They've pounded the ball inside in the first half. Forcing the defense to collapse, that could free up shooters going forward. Yeah, we've seen them burying their fair share of mid-range jumpers tonight, too. A good first half for them in that department. The first one falls. And what you love is every year, Karis LeVert takes another step. He adds something else to his game. And I believe, guys, this guy has future star written all over him. Both free throws good for LeVert. For Brooklyn, they've gotten 8 of 16 attempts to fall. Brown passes to Griffin. Here's Mann with the drive. Oh, the teardrop falls in. And another great assist. The offense is really clicking now. Smith outside. Pass to Lance. Now 
Now here's the bonus. Just five on the clock. Count it. His third and five attempts. And credit his teammates for feeding him all quarter. Brooklyn's gone only one of four from three-point land. Outside Mills. Fires at the elbow. Lamb grabs the miss. That's a decent look for him. He just couldn't convert. Here's Sabonis. Smith outside. Deflected! Outside, Brown. Back to Mills. Driving inside, uneasy two on the layup. Well, defensively, to me, you've got to do a better job communicating once the screen comes. Smith passes to Levert. Outside layup. For three, Smith. Griffin pulls down the board. Brooklyn trailing. Pass to Mills. A minute and a half left in the first quarter. Back to Griffin. Over Smith. And he buries that one. Back rim and in. And the Nets lead by one. Impressive. Their time ball out, movement out. has been excellent tonight. Indiana calls timeout. Yeah, Coach no doubt wants to use this timeout to review the matchups and maybe make some adjustments as well. And the guys get a little bit of a break. Mentally, physically, just recharge here quickly. The Nets making a switch here. Johnson's checked in. On defense, the Nets. There's a minute 12 left to play in the first. Here's Smith. He's off on that one. The Nets go the other way with it. Boy, a really tough quarter for this guy. Just struggling to make shots right now. Ooh, stolen by Smith. And out of bounds. The Nets will take it. Nets with the lead. And Brown, the bucket on the assist by Johnson. Setting each other up beautifully. I love it. Eight of their last ten points coming off assist. Smith finds a bonus. The three ball. Rebounded by Johnson. Brooklyn has gone only one of four from three-point land. Pass to man. 29 seconds left to play in the first quarter. He shoots again. Oh, Sabonis with a block. Improving on the defensive end as well. DeMontis Sabonis getting tenacious there with the block shot. Clock at four. Here's Mills. Now here's Smith. Right side land. Back to Smith. A shot to stop the drought. So at the end of one quarter of play, still a close game. It's the Nets. They lead by three. And we'll be back shortly for the start of the second quarter.
And he's one of the game's best closers. But to hear Kyrie Irving tell it, he's got to start, too. Of course, just wants me to be aggressive, uh, you know, to set the tone early in the game. And, you know, that kind of sets up all my teammates and uh, sets the standard for the rest of the game and how I want the, the game to go. You know, Grant, when he gets a lather going, Irving can seem like he's got the cheat code. Yeah, and if I'm the coach, he's got the green light from start to finish. When he gets rolling, it can rub off on everyone else. And time for us to get back into it here in game one. And a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for the Nets. You've got to like the consistency with which they're hitting that mid-range jumper so far. Well, something else they've done a good job of tonight is penetrating and getting points right at the rim. They've got Bruce Brown, Nicholas Claxton out there with James Johnson. Then there's Patrick Mills, and it's Mann in at the three spot. That's the Nets five as we get into the second quarter. You gotta love how they've been crashing the boards, fighting hard for every miss. Cash Mills with the bucket. Indiana trailing here. Quarter number two and about a minute in. Pass to Land. Takes a three. And once again, off the mark by Indiana. Well, Brooklyn's shooting 54% from the field so far in this one. Inside. Claxton down low. Working on Robinson. And Claxton gets the bucket. And now it's a nine-point Nets lead. Wow, they're really being taken advantage of defensively out there. No rim protection whatsoever. Up top, Smith. And it's Ish Smith with the foul. That's his first foul. And just a great job of getting there first and absorbing the contact. James Harden, he's checked in for Brooklyn. The Pacers also with a sub. Warren's checked in for Demona Sabonis. Pass to Claxton. Here's Mann, Robinson defending. And the officials signal the backcourt violation. Not careful there. Miscue there. Hadn't had many of those so far, which is a big reason they're ahead. Durant, he's checked in for Mann. McConnell with it. We're now about two minutes into the second quarter. To a certain extent, you like the aggressiveness, but that's two fouls already. Take a step back. Harris has checked in for Brooklyn. Irving comes in for Brown. Joe Harris. Larry Irving. Here's Warren. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. And the shot goes in. Nice sequence off the inbound. Ball movement and player movement creating the good look. Now here's Harden. Pass to Durant. McConnell with a steal. Levert up top. Defended by Harden. And here in the second quarter of action. Just a hair under two and a half minutes played. Here's LeVert. That one drops for him. Now just a five-point Brooklyn lead. Boy, that's just about strength right there. Harris LeVert just simply refuses to be denied. And that's a foul called on T.J. McConnell. That'll be a second foul of the game. And the Nets making a change here. Aldridge is checked in. For your Nets, Marcus Aldridge. Finds Durant. Shot clock at six. Over Levert. That's short off the rim. The Pacers have gotten two of five shots to fall this second quarter. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. It's on LaMarcus Aldridge. This guy doesn't mind absorbing contact at all if it means a trip to the free throw line. Karis LeVert will find his points any way you want. No 
No good on the free throw. He hits the second from the line. The Nets have gotten three or four field goals in the second quarter. Here's Durant. Oh, you missed wow. that. Get out the way, Greg. Come on. Get out the way. Well, Kevin Durant with a little crafty creativity. KD at the rim. Now here's McConnell. Clock at six. Here's LeVert and Durant with the block. Well, Kevin Durant is playing spectacular defense and it sets the tone for the entire team. Aldridge passes to Harden. Goes back up. No good off the back of the rim. Well, Indiana shooting about 41%. Here's LeVert. And he banks in the layup. LeVert's got 10 points. Well, this is one aspect you'd like to see more of from T.J. Warren. We know he's a great scorer. Pretty dime there. Harden against McConnell. The shot. Jump shot is good. Six points for him. And here are the Pacers now. Pass to Duarte. Now Turner. And it's LaMarcus Aldridge with the foul. That'll be a second foul of the game. And just wasn't able to set up in time. McConnell outside. Now Warren. Five on the clock. Here's Turner. And the 10-footer finds the target. Turner's gotten his second bucket. They just look so overwhelmed inside. You know, that's why they continue to get attacked. Harden finds Irving. Durant against McConnell. Durant, the pass to Harden. Oh, and Turner with a block. And he's able to get it back. Second chance effort. That one a little long. That's the shot they wanted. It just didn't fall. I think expect them to go back to it because that's the kind of shot this offense is designed to generate. Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Not afraid to get in the paint and get wet. Outside Irving. Outside Harden. Pass to Aldridge. Here's the three. Not going to go that time. So Indiana will take it the other way. Harden against Warren. That's tipped. And pushing it up the floor. Here comes Brooklyn. And that's going to be a travel. Griffin, he's checked in for Brooklyn. Boy, Griffin. For Indiana, they've gotten over 50% of their shots to go. Five for nine in the second. Lavert goes against Harris. Outside for McConnell. Pass to Duarte. To the left wing. Back to Turner. Down to five on the shot clock. Free throw line jumper. And it's Warren missing. Brooklyn has gone 0 for 2 from outside in the second quarter. Durant, pass to Griffin. Harris outside. Here's Durant. That falls. Nice setup by Harris. Durant's gotten four this quarter. This guy has been a catalyst for them all game long. What a job leading them to this lead. Outside Warren. Outside for McConnell.
to the inside. Here's Duarte. And even after two offensive rebounds, they just can't take the lid off. Harris passes to Irving. Down low. Oh, and Turner with a block. Harris against McConnell. Over Harris. McConnell, good. McConnell's got six points. And their offensive game plan is clear. Get it inside and go to work. Outside Harden. Three-pointer. Oh, and Turner with a block. And he gets it back. That's going to be over and back. Not watching the line on that one. The Pacers making a switch here. Robinson's checked in. Now McConnell. He has six. Pass to Turner. Here's Duarte. He's guarded by Irving. It's good. And he drew contact on the shot, so he will go to the line. A three-point play opportunity. Mills, he's checked in for James Harden. Lamb's checked in for Indiana. Smith comes in for McConnell. Now they lead as the free throw drops in for him. The Nets have gone 6 of 14 in the second quarter. Outside Mills. Durant for three. Offensive rebound. Harris' shot is good. Six points for him. Well, Joe Harris known as a shooter, but make no mistake, this guy will mix it up on the glass. Great offensive rebound right there. Pass to Warren. Over Harris. And it's Warren missing. The Nets have gotten 7 of 16 shots to go in the second. Harris down low. He's covered by Warren. That's his fourth miss in seven shots. Back to Smith. To the paint. And he goes in for the dunk. Well, T.J. Warren finishes with authority. We'll give you a salute, sir. Brooklyn trailing. Here's Durant. He's got nine. Griffin outside. Outside Mills. Count it. Good. Mills has got four points this quarter. All right, starting to heat up now. He's been much more efficient with the shot in this quarter than in the first. His first foul. Team's fifth foul. Shooting for Indiana. Biff Smith. Two shots. First free throw is good. Brooklyn making some changes. Claxton, he's checked in for Kevin Durant. Mann comes in for Harris. And it's Brown in for Irving. And the Pacers also making a change. Sabonis checked in. Good on both. Brooklyn has gone 0 for 4 from beyond the arc here in the second quarter. Pass to Mills. Back to Claxton. And that one makes him two for two. He's in his rhythm. Oh, man, this has been an absolute battle in the first half. Each team trying to establish itself. The lead just keeps going back and forth. Now here's Smith. Here's Sabonis. Defended by Griffin. Takes a 13-footer. Sabonis can't hit. They've been dominating the boards tonight, yet it's still a close game. Here's man outside Brown. Claxton down low. Lamb covering. Claxton can't get it to go. Indiana trailing here. A minute 29 left in the half. Knocks it down from distance. 
three. Smith's got seven. What a beautiful stroke from range. Defensively, you've got to try to take him out of his comfort zone. And here's Mills. He has six. Pass to Griffin. Over Sabonis. Pacers with a rebound. Sabonis has got his fifth rebound in this one. Inside. Count it. He's four for eight now. And since the first quarter, we've seen them reduce their attempts from downtown. And quite frankly, I think that's a good idea. Outside Mills. Pass to Brown. And here's Griffin. Shoots over Sabonis. No good off the glass. There's 31 seconds left to play in the second quarter. Here's Smith. There's the drive. Goes up and lays it in nice and easy. And now a six-point Indiana lead. Good job attacking. Those restricted area shots are what every NBA team is looking for. Outside Mills. Six to shoot. Pass to Brown. They need this. Pure from three-point range. He's got five. And we're through the first half of play here in what's been a good one. It's the Pacers up by three. And we'll be right back after halftime for the start of the third quarter. See you in just a bit. Thanks for joining us again for round one of the NBA playoffs. Boy, you got to like what we're seeing from Karis LeVert. Yeah, they've done an amazing job of creating room to operate for him. And then, of course, executing. But one of the things every player is after is efficiency at the offensive end. And boy, this young guy has done just that. Hello, everyone. Thank you for joining 2K Sports and our coverage of this first round. Second half underway. Here's who Rick Carlisle's got on the floor. Sabonis and Turner work together inside. Then it's T.J. Warren. Then there's T.J. McConnell. And it's Dorte in at the two-guard spot. And that's shooting about 47%. A nice number. Harris against Sabonis. Harris right side. Ooh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. Boy, Joe Harris refusing to give an inch, and he is rewarded with a trip to the free throw line. Nicely done. Free throw drops for Harris. Well, think about Joe Harris, the 33rd pick in the 2014 draft. So that's the third pick in the second round. And boy, has he turned himself into a viable NBA player. Knockdown shooter who can now put it on the deck as well. So he picks up just one from the line that time. Indiana leading. Here's Duarte. Pass to McConnell. Now here's Warren. Here's Duarte. McConnell left side. And there it is for him. McConnell's got eight points. Well, deliver the pass where your teammate can do something with it. Nice. Outside Harden. Pass to Durant. Outside Irving. And the layup is good off the glass. How about the great body control by Kyrie Irving? One of the best small men in the league at converting to contact. Just over one and a half minutes have passed in the third quarter. Sabonis, the fader. Again, Indiana. And, and they keep on figuring out ways to force the rock inside and convert. 
O'Connell against Harden. Pass to Durant. Launches a three. Dorte grabs the board. The Pacers have got two of three from the floor in this third quarter. And here's McConnell, pounded by Harris. Now here's Sabonis. Shoots over Durant. Oh, denied by Durant. And he gets it back. Here's Sabonis. Rebound Brooklyn. Durant's got four rebounds now. Just under two and a half minutes into this third quarter now. McConnell with it. Harden picks him up. To the right side. McConnell outside. Back to Warren. Releases. And the jumper is good. He's got six. Well, this is T.J. Warren's role, right? We know he's a professional scorer. He's aggressive shooting that jump shot. Durant with the bucket. Keeping pace here. That's an excellent move inside. The Pacers have gotten three of six shots to fall so far in the third. Outside Warren. Here's Dorte. He's guarded by Irving. Here's Warren. Good setup. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. Warren's got four points in the quarter. Brooklyn trailing. Harden, the pass to Durant. And that's a foul called on Devonis Sabonis. That's his first foul. These calls can be so difficult for officials to make. So the Nets making a switch here. Johnson's checked in. Levert's checked in for Indiana. His shot was hindered by that momentous mobile one block. Yeah, this is the elevated energy level you expect in the postseason. Chasing down blocks and making an impact. Just under three and a half minutes played here in the third quarter. Harden into the lane. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. And Harden's got eight points. Boy, that's three for four this half. You like that they're starting with a little bit of extra energy. Nice. Pass to Duarte. Back to McConnell. Here's Duarte. Shot clock at five. That shot missing. And Brooklyn going the other way now. Irving up top. He's covered by Warren. To the middle. Here's Aldridge. Oh, and Turner with a block. And as it goes out of bounds, Brooklyn able to keep possession. On the wing, Durant. Turner covers. Count it. 13 points in the game. Kevin Durant on a prototypical KD roll. My man is going. Left side, Warren. Durant pulls it in. Durant's got rebound number five here tonight. And they take the lead. And the Nets lead by one. Here in the second half, this game's still nip and tuck. <laughs> Just an insane amount of lead changes. The fans are getting their money's worth. Ooh, Durant with a steal. It's a one-on-one -on -one situation. Let's go with a three. The Pacers pull it in. Well, when you've been struggling as he has, you love that your teammates have really stepped up and taken the challenge. Warren. Oh, no good again that time. Warren against Johnson. Pass to Durant. Durant draws the double. Right side, Johnson. Clock at six. Ooh, nice concentration to hit the double clutch layup. Now it's a three-point Brooklyn lead. Oh, fantastic adjustment on the shot against tight defense. Time called here. Indiana decides to talk it over. And now that they have some time to get a little bit of rest, it's time for these players to regroup while hydrating themselves with some Gatorade looking to gain a boost of energy as they continue to play in this game. And staying hydrated is the only surefire way to do it. An athlete's body doesn't have the same power and stamina without proper hydration. These guys will be sure to use this timeout wisely.
man. He's checked in for Brooklyn. Lamb's checked in for Indiana. McConnell with it. Give him eight. Just five to shoot. There's the drive. That one goes in. McConnell's got four points now in the quarter. Brooklyn has gone just one of three from deep since the break. Here's Durant. Gets the bucket and the foul. And they'll give that one to Miles Turner. He got the foul. Miles Turner. And let's take a moment here to get your take, guys, on the scoring so far for the Nets. Their mid-range shooting has been tremendous all game, guys. There hasn't been a drop-off at all. Yeah, something else that stands out tonight is how many assists they have. Robinson, he's checked in for Indiana. Now, Kevin Durant is an absolute nightmare for defenses. And if you're the opposing coach and he starts to take over, you've got to be thinking, what am I going to do with this guy? Oh, there's the alley! Oh, incredible! Save that one. I want to watch it again. Awesome! Brooklyn with the ball. They're on a 14-6 run. Harden against McConnell. Pass to Irving. Over Lamb. No good. A bit long that time. For Indiana, they've gotten six of their first 12 shots to drop in this third. McConnell passes to Warren. And here is Lamb. Falls for Indiana. He is too good a mid-range shooter to leave him that open. Robinson against Durant. Over Warren. Oh, he clanks that one off the back iron and it falls. Durant's got 18 points. Well, listen, you do the best you can to make Kevin Durant take tough shots, but this guy, lightning quick release, unbelievable shooter, so hard to guard him. Irving, the pass to Harden. Outside Irving. Pass to Durant. It's rebounded by Indiana. McConnell outside. He takes it in. Oh! Denied by Durant. Stolen by Lamb. Indiana again missing. The Nets have gone 8 of 13 in the second half. The shot, no good. And Indiana will come the other way. For the lead. And it's Harden who pulls down the rebound. Harden's got his fifth rebound in this one. Man, man, a strong finish with two hands. I just love the aggressive finish. Now I'm thinking he's sending a strong message with that jam. And that's a foul called on T.J. McConnell. That's his third foul of the game. Boy, his ball security flawless in the first half, but since then, it's an absolute disaster. So Brooklyn going with almost an entire new group here. Claxton, he's checked in for Kevin Durant. Griffin comes in for Johnson. Brown, he's checked in for Kyrie Irving. And it's Mills in for Harden. And the Pacers also making a change. Smith, he's checked in for McConnell. Mills attacking. Robinson with the block. This guy's nose for the basketball, and his timing as a shot blocker is intimidating. Mitchell Robinson so quick off his feet. So it's the Pacers now, trailing by four. Now Smith, he's got nine. Throws it up high, and a big finished by Robinson. Guys, he's such a big target. On the alley, you throw it up. Mr. Robinson, the only one in the building who can catch it and finish. Outside Mills. Up and over Smith. Ooh, stolen by Smith. Levert outside. Pass to Smith for the lead. Rebound Brooklyn. Claxton's got his fifth rebound in this one. Outside Mills. 
kick out to Brown. Six on the shot clock. Now Griffin. Lamb covering. Another shot. And it's finished off by Griffin as he lays it in. And the Nets lead by four. The D hasn't been quick enough to react to the ball inside. That's helped cause this run. Smith outside. Pass to Levert. Shot from the top of the key. Called in by Brown. I think this is a spot he has got to become more consistent from. If you want to command the defender's respect. Outside Mills. The three. He buries it from three. Now it's a seven-point Brooklyn lead. This is as pure a shooter as there is. You've got to stay connected or it's a problem. Warren, the pass to Levert. Hey, now five for eight. Shooting a pretty good percentage right now. Harris Levert, great confidence in his ability to get off the dribble drive and make things happen. Pass to Brown. Down low. Robinson with a steal. 107 left in the third quarter. Outside land. From the wing. Rebounded by the Nets. Here's Mann. To the inside. Here's Claxton. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. At the line, Nicholas Claxton. And at the line, shooting two. And he makes a first. Some changes for Brooklyn. Aldridge comes in for Griffin. And Harris is subbed in for Mann. The Pacers making a switch here. Both good from the line that time. There's 49 seconds left to play in the third quarter of basketball. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Shots good by Sabonis. Sabonis has got 12 points. That's three buckets in a row off assists. Outside Mills. Harris outside. From deep. It's rebounded by Sabonis. Indiana has got nothing to fall from outside in this third quarter. And he lobs it up. Hey, great communication on the lob. Well, just tremendous hustle by Mitchell Robinson, working hard to find that shot opportunity. Outside Mills. The three. And no good. Kevin Durant has been leading the charge for the Nets. Hunting for opportunities, leading to nine points in the quarter. All right, stick around. We'll be right back after this. And it's time now to bring you our State Farm assist to the game. You know, I'm kind of stoked this was a choice because I love this pass. A remarkable find. He put his court vision on full display. Well, making the game easy for your teammates. All about putting them in a position to score. That's pretty. It's the fourth quarter crowd. And thanks for sticking with us as this round one game continues. Harrison Durant in as the forwards. Bruce Brown is out there with Patrick Mills. And it's Aldridge in at the center, filling out the middle. So that's the Nets five. Cash Mills with the 
bucket. Indiana trailing here. Pass to Duarte. Inside. Here's Robinson. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. Durant. Pass to Aldridge. Harris against LeVert. He shoots. And Brooklyn again with a bucket. So smooth with the shot mechanics. Joe Harris, what a pretty jumper. Smith outside. Pass to Robinson. LeVert with the ball. Off target from three-point range. They are just owning the boards right now. Durant, pass to Aldridge. And it's in there. And now it's a nine-point Brooklyn lead. Boy, what wonderful vision. Kevin Durant with a picture-perfect pass. Woo-hoo! Robinson with it. He's covered by Aldridge. Robinson passes to Smith. And the three off target. You kind of wonder where his head's at. The shot selection hasn't been there. And, of course, that one was just crazy. Indiana. That's his second official. First team foul. At the line, shooting for Brooklyn. Patrick Mills. At the line, two times. And the first one at the line is good. And they've been so much more aggressive drawing the whistle here in the second half. Turner, he's checked in for Indiana. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Final quarter here, and we're just over a minute and a half through it. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. Pass to LeVert. Five to shoot. Indiana needs to get a shot off. And Durant with the block. Kept alive. Here's Sabonis. Oh, persistence pays off as they finally hit a shot. Well, DeMontis Sabonis has a nose for the basketball. He understands if he keeps moving, he's going to get to the offensive glass. And so the ball out of bounds. Brown touched it last. Kyrie Irving's checked in for Brown. Kyrie Irving. The Pacers have got one out of six shots to fall in this final quarter. Not ideal. Here's Turner, lays it up and in off the pretty assist. Miles Turner covered tightly, but nonetheless scores it. That is really well done. Outside Mills, pass to Harris. Back to Mills, shot clock at six, shoots. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. That'll belong to Demonis Sabonis. Well, Kevin Durant is so crafty. He is outstanding at forcing the issue and drawing fouls. First free throw is good. So the Nets making a switch here. Harden's checked in. And the Pacers also making a change. McConnell, he's checked in for Smith. And good on the second, so he makes them both. This is what makes him a challenge to stop. He will beat you from the floor, and he can also beat you from the line. McConnell passes to Turner. Harris against LeVert. And it's Kevin Durant with the foul. That's his first foul. And yeah, he, he still was moving at the point of contact.
third minute of action now gone here in the fourth. Turner finds the bird. Clock at six. Sabonis outside. From deep three-point range. And they recover it. Back to McConnell. And there's the foul. It'll go on Kyrie Irving. That's his first foul of the game. A look at the clock. A little under three and a half minutes gone by in the fourth. Turner. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Turner's got four points in the quarter. Miles Turner has great versatility, so he can score from anywhere, but right there is his bread and butter. Pass to Harden. From deep. It's rebounded by Sabonis. Sabonis has got rebound number 11. Now Levert. Sabonis outside. To Levert. Oh, stolen by Harris. Here's Irving. He blocks it again. A defensive stalwart so far. That's six blocks. Protecting the rim well. Love the hustle. Puts it up off the inbound. Ooh, buries it despite the hack. Terrific play. He'll have a chance for one more now. It's on T.J. McConnell. T.J. McConnell. That's his fourth personal foul. Third team foul. At the line, shooting for Brooklyn. James Harden. At the line, one shot. That's good from Harden. For Indiana, they've gotten just three of nine shots to go in, struggling this fourth quarter. Levert goes against Durant. Here's Sabonis. Uses the glass on the layup. Sabonis has got four points in the quarter. Don't you just love watching DeMontis Sabonis get to his spots? This guy's so creative on the offensive end. Harden, the pass to Irving. From deep three-point range, Levert with a rebound. Well, this has not been his finest hour, but give your teammates some credit for doing the job of stepping in. McConnell finds the vert. Five on the clock. Fires the three. Gets a hand on it. Oh, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Miles Turner is simply a workhorse. I mean, he keeps plays alive with his length and activity. Harden against McConnell. Here's the ramp. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. At the line, KD. At the line, two times. Throws good from Durant. He's forcing the action now. Finally getting to the charity stripe after no freebies in the first half. Warren's checked in for Levert. And both free throws good for Durant. And here's McConnell. Pass to Duarte. Now here's Warren. On the take. And here's McConnell. Now here's Turner. Here's Duarte. And he didn't get quite enough under that one. Outside Harden. This one for three. They grab their own miss. Nice shot by Duran. 
Well, with his combination of length and time and athleticism, Kevin Durant is beating the glass right now. Time called here. Indiana decides to talk it over. We get DJ and they're free. Who wants what? Come on, make some noise. Let's send it over to Allie LaForce. Well, over the break, I listened in on Rick Carlisle's huddle. He was trying to ignite some fire, saying, where's the fight, you guys? You know we can compete with this team, but we're letting them run all over us. We've got to level up the aggressiveness. Back to you. All right, appreciate it, Allie. The way they've hit the offensive boards in the second half, you would think they're the team that's leading. Pass to Durant. And trying to put the game away, he's been nails all evening. And he hasn't forced much tonight. I love the efficiency he's giving to them. They're starting a new trend with regard to turnovers. It's becoming problematic. Harden, the pass to Aldridge. Now here's Harris. Now here's Harden. He's marked by McConnell. Knocked loose. Out of bounds, it'll be Pacers ball. To the paint, here's Sabonis, and Sabonis slams it in! I'll tell you, DeMontis Sabonis has got some big-time athleticism. That's a pretty dunk. Timeout called. Brooklyn. Time now to present our new balance player of the game, T.J. McConnell. And there was absolutely nothing they could do to slow him down in this one. It seemed like every shot he put up went in. <laughs> and his teammates responded smartly by continuing to feed him all night. Hart, the pass to Aldridge. On the wing, Durant. Shoots over Turner. The Pacers pull it in. Turner's got a rebound number five here tonight. Here's Sabonis. And they're going to count that bucket. And they'll send him to the line. It could be a three-point play. Well, this quarter has been all about this guy. He is trying to close the gap in the score. for Indiana. Sabonis. One time for the line.
Musa. Free throw drops for Sabonis. You know, it's such a pleasure to watch DeMontis Sabonis play the game. Yes, he's got absolutely God-given talent, but he also has an incredible understanding and feel for the game, and he plays it the right way. Offensive rebound. Aldridge passes to Harris. Yes, and a nice assist from Aldridge. Harris has got four points in the quarter. Coming out of the half, making a commitment to the offensive boards has proven successful. And there's the foul. It'll go on Kyrie Irving. That's foul number two for him. Fourteen. Pass to Duarte. Back to McConnell. Six to shoot. And the layup falls. You can't ask for a better look with the game in the balance. For Brooklyn, they've gotten seven to go out of 13 attempts during the fourth. Harden, the pass to Irving. Durant with it. It's kept alive. And he'll take a trip to the line for two. Clearly got fouled on that shot. A master of attracting contact. Harden just takes pride in fooling defenders and getting those calls. Shooting for Brooklyn. James Harden. And out the line. Shooting two. And he drops the first. And so he hits both. Indiana trailing here. McConnell outside. Pass to Duarte. Sabonis with it. Nice D from Durant. Good job hitting the glass. They're plus eight in rebound. Aldridge outside. Here's Irving. Let's it fly. And the Nets miss again. The Pacers shooting 47% since the fourth quarter started. McConnell passes to Turner. No luck on that one. The Nets go the other way with it. They've led by as many as 11 to the middle. And it's slammed in by Durant. Well, this is the court awareness that Joe Harris gives you. He is so skilled at realizing how to give his teammates an open look. Time called here. Indiana decides to talk it over. They've committed enough fouls to be in the penalty already. Not good. They really need to concentrate on playing strong defense without getting too physical. Here's McConnell. Inside. Here's Sabonis. The putback. It's good on the putback. 
And I'll tell you, despite this guy's strong play in this period, they're still behind. Someone else has got to step up. Harden against McConnell. Harden, the pass to Aldridge. Back to Harden. The basket is good. Off the setup from Aldridge. Aldridge has got his third assist of the night. Harden just loves scoring from contact. He seeks it out while trying to get fouls on his shooting attempts. And that was good. Well, as usual, this guy cooking on the offensive end. But right now, the other guys on his team have got to step forward. Sabonis against Durant to the inside. Here's Harden. Ooh, he connects. His seventh basket. He's 7 of 15 now. I love it. When Harden shoots, he commits. A little contact isn't going to upset his mechanics. Over to the wing. Sabonis in the post. Durant's there. Sabonis, the pass to Turner. Ooh, Durant with some nice D. Well, we didn't see the same kind of control we're used to seeing from him. This guy is usually a tremendous finisher. Pass to Harris. Oh, and Turner with a block. And that's out of bounds. Brooklyn will retain possession. Mills, he's checked in for Brooklyn. And so it's Brooklyn with it. They've got a nine-point lead. One sixteen left in the fourth quarter. McConnell against Irving. And Sabonis the bucket on the assist from McConnell. Sabonis has got 29. Well, what you love is Sabonis has both the athleticism and the strength to play through contact. Nice. Down low. Oh, stolen by Turner. You know, I think it's desperation time for them. I'll tell you, you need absolute perfection on every possession. That's what it's going to take here. Durant against Warren. Pass to Harris. Here's Aldridge. Oh, and he nails it from the high post. On offense, LaMarcus is so dependable. He's ready to make the play from wherever he is on the floor. Here's Sabonis, guarded by Durant. And count the basket. He was fouled, and he's going to the line for one more. Sabonis. And they go to the intentional foul. At the line, shooting for Brooklyn. Captain Thomas. Stepping the line with two shots. the first one and that makes it a seven point lead so he gets them both and it's an eight point ball game and you know they're extremely disappointed right now. I mean, this one getting away from them. Well, they definitely have some things to work out. And you'd love to see them finish this game the right way. McConnell. They get it back. Great positioning on the putback. No fear. Under duress. Big time moment. And DeMontis Sabonis delivers. And he commits the intentional foul. 
Yeah, and there's no question they have to foul. Now, I'm sure they would have preferred to avoid it. Good on the first, and that makes it a seven-point lead. So both free throws good, and it's an eight-point ball game. Indiana calls timeout. They're down by eight. There's ten seconds left to play in the fourth quarter. Here's Smith. Tries a three off the inbound. Aldridge pulls down the board. Mills with it. So we see the Nets get the win here. And it always takes a lot of pressure off a team when they get the win in game one. It's the most important game of the series. They've shown they know how to beat this team. The formula's in place. Now they just have to stick with it for the next few games. All right, Allie's ready to go. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. James, night in and night out, this team comes ready to perform. What does this win say about your collective focus? We've got that same mentality all year long. You know, whether it's bad record teams or guys in and out the lineups, we just had a mindset all season that uh, this year is going to be special. So, um, you know, no matter who it is we play, we go out there and just try to compete at a high level and win as many games as we can. It's about you, not the opponent. You got that right. Thanks, James. All right, Allie, thank you. Well, that'll do it for now. Glad you could join us during the first round of the Eastern Conference playoffs. For Doris Burke, Allie LaForce, and Grant Hill, and our entire crew, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for tuning in. So long, everyone.